Hi everyone. I have another tour of home to do. This is Beagle, my friend Beagle. He's on the Mystic Mayhem server and we want to tour his base and see what all he's done here. So let's go over here and say hi Beagle. How are you doing today? I'm good sir. How are you? Great. If you could do a, a quick tour of your base that would be awesome. Sure. Step right in. Okay. Thank you. This is good. So this is like my small crafting area. Yeah. Um, oh my! my. You, the, you're all set up with all your furnaces here. Mhm. Mm and then through here, this door is my loot room. Oh, perfect! This is really good. You've got lots of space to put lots of stuff. And if you'd like to follow me. Oh boy, we're going up the stairs. Sorry, put some stairs there. Okay. Through here. Oh, this looks fancy. I've got my fabricator and my complimentary spears. Oh. So oh, this is neat. Is this a let's see, disp spear display stand? Oh my goodness, that looks really cool. I've got my bookshelf. Oh yeah. Yeah, like now that that is not com working completely correct or at the point, right? At this point. Oh, I don't think it is. Yeah. They're gonna fix that, I'm sure. Through here is the master bedroom. Oh, complete oh with... look at this thing. What is this? A sarcophagus? <laughs> That's mm -hmm. so cool. Does it do anything or it's just one of the statues no, that you can get in the ruins? That yeah. is very cool looking. I'm not seeing here. that. Awesome. Okay. It's my party deck. We don't need to worry about that turned on. Yeah? Oh. Yeah, this is... <laughs> that, that, that was... that. Did you shoot that with a rifle? Mm, a shotgun. Oh, a and shotgun. If you look just southwest. Yeah? That is one of our players' holiday homes. Oh, that's very cute. They can come spend the holiday at you, near your home and have a vacation, huh? Mm-hmm. That's very fun. Okay. It's my shop. Oh, yes. And I am here to buy some lanterns. Some uh, They're called lamps, I believe. You get them in um, ruins. They are called gold lampstands. Gold lampstands. Okay, they're getting ruins, but I have not had time to go into some ruins but I need the lamps badly. All right, I'm going to buy something from Beagle's shop. The name of his shop is Beagle's Best Buy. So I want to buy some items and uh, he has assured me that he has them on hand. I need lots of lamps because I'm working down in my mine and I need to light up my mine quite a bit. So Beagle's currency is going to be Magic Sleepy Arrows and he takes 10 magic sleepy arrows for 10 lamps. He goes into the ruins and these dungeons a lot. So he, ha he is able to get all of those items that are so fun to have in your home. And so he's going to trade some um, land lamps and some jars, large jars for me. Um, Beagle, I have... 37 arrows, sleepy, magic sleepy arrows, and so five of that is a tip for you, or tax, or whatever you want to call it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. And then he's going to exchange, he's going to give me some of these lamps. Let me show you. Um, yes. There's the large jars. I have the perfect place. I want to put those in front of the magic wizard building. And then the golden lamp stands. Let me, I want to show you guys what these golden lamp stands do. Let's move over here and show you. They are so neat. Isn't that awesome? And you don't have to, you don't have to fuel them, right, Beagle? They need no fuel. The only they problem I can no find with them is they're missing a te texture on the top. Oh, but that is just really great. And now he gave me enough that I oh and you can pick them up I'm glad I didn't even think to ask about that you can pick and them up also, so that's the reflection good. on it is a natural reflection you can see yourself oh 
<laughs> so, anyway, this is Beagle's shop as part of the tour of homes. And he's here to sell us items, uh, especially that he gets in the ruins and in the dungeons from around Pixar land and Mystic Mayhem server. So, we're really happy to have him do that. Also, I think he has some more of his home. He's going to show it. us. I've good, got good. Some, off, some offshore sites. Did you make like it through your maze. And uh, you have a, you're working on a magic room, I believe. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. Very fun. You do have spring boots, don't you? Because oh, yes. Let me put, my, let me put mistake. my boots back on because... They're good for going up and down. All right, perfect. Here we go. Wow, this is a really neat how you um, have it kind of hidden, isn't it? I don't think anybody would know it's here if you didn't show them. Perfect. This is really great. So you have all of your magic tables, magic crafting tables down here. And uh, you're going to be able to pull storage right it's a massive box right here it's just enough to reach all my boxes on the inside wow that is great that is so fun so this is a work in progress you had told me so you'll be mm -hmm. working on this and finishing this room up i really like the like decorations on the marble and the marble door looks quite i think it looks quite yes good. oh my gosh this is the marble door you know i have not crafted this yet i had no idea that looks really neat. I love this. Perfect. I love that how the, how the detail on it. Now let's see if I can make my way out. Let's see if to, to work these boots. Oops. Move over a little bit. You hold down your space bar for quite a while, and then you lift up, and it helps you. You kind of like you charge your boots, don't you? <laughs> mm -hmm. That works really good. So, would you like to go and see my giant animal cave pen? I would. I really want to. Let's see here. This is amazing. I'll go slightly into the golden biome, but nothing can get in here. So, from the top, oh, I don't mind the giant gate. It, I'm trying to make it look slightly blend in. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I can't. I don't see any. Oh, I see it now. Yes, it's very well blended in. Perfect for this area. Yeah, this is awesome. So then you just <gasps> drop. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Run. Oh, there. No. No beagle, no. Oh my gosh. Oh. Maybe he'll get this cool. kangaroo. Oh, cool dear. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh. Look, it's your time. I need to go get my Argent. The Argent will take care of this thing. Maybe if I don't die. Is he still coming? Oh, no. He left. Good. Oh, my gosh. That was crazy. Oh. Did I you make would it watch back? Up? jumping down. There's a elemental spirit. Did you make it back safely? I am on flip-flop. Okay, good. Perfect. Oh, my goodness. You were just saying how... How your animals are safe, but it's not safe getting there. So you have to be careful to get down to your animals. Yeah, we're not safe, but they are. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Oh. oh, there's that elemental spirit. Oh, you know what? I have not seen those. Are they? Oh, they are aggressive. They're a one-shot. He's kid. after your pteranodon. There's also no! some. No, your pteranodon. Let's find that pteranodon with free. Oh, you've got flip-flop now, so no worries. Wow! My gosh! And they drop uh, the water stones. Oh, they do. Those are really cool looking. I, I don't think any of us have tamed one of those, have we? Have I, do you know of anybody that's tamed one? Water I'm going to come back spirit. around the other way. I'm not sure I can jump down that far. Um, they're untamable. Oh, they are not tameable. Oh. Alright, so I'm making my way down into the animal pen. Awesome. This is great. So they are all safe down here, but getting here is kind of scary. <laughs> and if you go to the left, just over here before me, okay. it goes quite deep. 
It is really, really. I can fit wow. anything up here. Make sure and stay on this edge. Oh my goodness, this is a huge canyon. Wow, you can put lots of animals back in here. You could put all the animals in here. Yeah, this is great. And it's completely it's completely covered in. There's no like place for danger to come in. Well that is awesome. So fun. And so here's all your animals, so they're easily accessible. I was looking at your um, armadillo. Those are really neat looking. I definitely need to do a video and showing about press, those. If you open him up, you can see. You can smell on him. Oh, wow. Look at that. You can make glass and iron ingots. It's just like a smelter. Well, He's that smelter. is really neat. I just love their color. I love how they look. So fun. And... Um, much as me. <laughs> That's you need, awesome. You need, to, you need to kill these guys to get to get the stuff for the lava pit. It's yes. really red drop. Yes, and I've I understand that those are difficult that they're they're super rare to drop the actual shell. Like the um, they're about as rare as the archery feathers. Yes. Yes. I definitely want to do an Argent outfit, but they those are really difficult too. How many feathers do you think you got? Oh, I have one so far, but um, I have, like I said, I haven't had time to go exploring too much. So once I finish my... Oh, the archers are attacking my house. Oh, no, no, Don't no. Worry. My rifle was taking short care of them. Oh, yeah. There's that... a tamed one. Oh, that's yours. Oh, no. No, 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 no. no yours no. is fine. I killed them. Oh, okay. Goodness sakes alive. Always something going on at Beagle's house. Whether it's a T-Rex attack, whether it's a ghost dragon attack. <laughs> uh, crimson laid an egg. Oh my goodness. Crimson? Shadow. I didn't think you... I would have thought you would be on passive. Did I not put you on passive? It's good to keep your birds on passive, otherwise they fly away. No. Crimson is on neutral. What were they attacking? I wonder... I think they're just fighting each other because nothing of mine is damaged. There we go. It's good to put birds on passive because otherwise they'll just attack and attack and attack and you, then they disappear. Where's this mushroom? What's this? Is this growing in? Oh no, that's an egg. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> yeah. oh, goodness sake. Do you want to see something? Do you want to see some of my weapons? Yes. Let me, let me look at this amazing gun that you've been killing some of your... I've got two good guns. But you can feel free to pick up and here's the ammo. Pick you them can up and look at them. Okay, let's look. There's um, some ammo there. For the so rifle. there is a. You have a magical apprentice long neck with sniper bullets. That has the fire, but I do not have any fire ammo. And then you have uh, a magical apprentice pump action shotgun, fire type uh, shotgun ammo. Now. So did you get these like this? Oh, here's an here's the ammo. Okay, well, I'm, you, I don't think I'm going to shoot them, but I just want to show. There's a precopted on right here. Wow. Oh no, no, I don't want to shoot them. I just want to show them so that people can learn a little bit about them. Okay, before I go, I want to show you a uh, big. Nice view of what uh, Beagle's base looks like from a distance. He's done a lot of work and it looks amazing. Thank you so much, Beagle, for showing us your house. We appreciate it so much. And thank you guys for coming along with us on the ride. He's just done a really great job. We'll end the little video here, and hopefully we can do another tour of home very, very soon. But for now, I appreciate each and every one of you so very, very much. Bye for now. Bye.